Um, do you want to maybe explain just for people how how peak current control works? Sure, absolutely. So. Um, in the converter, you have a uh, error amplifier, uh, usually a transconductive type, or sometimes it's a voltage error amplifier uh, that's looking at the feedback voltage uh, and comparing to a reference um, so that sets your regulation voltage. Um, and then uh, the output of that is a, called the error signal. And then the error signal is compared to a um, the current information, uh, the inductor current, usually measured from the high side uh, switch. Uh, there's also a slope compensation ramp that's added to avoid uh, subharmonic oscillation. Um, do you want to quick talk through what the harmonic oscillation is and and why that's an issue? Sure. Yeah. In uh, so in uh, peak current mode uh, control with fixed frequency, uh, if you did not have uh, uh, if you did not have slope compensation, um, which is a fixed ramp that gets added to the uh, the inductor information. Um, there would be a, a situation where if you have a duty cycle greater than 50%, uh, it would actually um, alternate between a large pulse and a, and a skinny pulse. Um, we can, we can yeah, we can, show, yeah, we can show what that looks like. Yeah. yeah. Um, and so this gives you a uh, beat frequency at half the switching frequency where you're alternating between these two, um, these two widths, which would create a nasty EMI and, and ripple situation. Okay, so even with the peak current control, if you get into that harmonic, then you have all sorts of yeah. you know, EMI broadcasting issues. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So like if you were switching at two megahertz, then the subharmonic would be at one megahertz, which is right in the AM band. Okay. Uh, so if you have an AM radio in the car, that would okay. interfere with that. Okay. Um, so with that being the dominant con control uh, concept that people are using, um, are there you know other any other advantages that 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 allows um, designers to have? I mean, they obviously are familiar with it because they've used it for a long time. Any other thing? Yeah, yeah absolutely. The familiarity is a big thing. I yeah. think people are comfortable with uh, peak current mode. Mm -hmm. They've used it for years. Uh, I mean, I, it's been uh, common since I joined the automotive industry over 15 years ago. Okay. 